बहुत स्वागत है हमारे चैनल प्रोसेस ड्रिवन पर आइए प्रोसेस स्टार्ट करते हैं कुछ लर्न करने का फार्मा सीरियलाइजेशन इन चाइना एज द कंट्री विद द लार्जेस्ट पॉपुलेशन चाइना आल्सो हैज वन ऑफ द लार्जेस्ट फार्मास्यूटिकल मार्केट्स इन द वर्ल्ड इन 2020 नियरली 35 बिलियन यूएस dollars were generated in pharmaceutical imports and the trend is upward in order to counteract counterfeiting and protect patients the regulations of pharma serialization in china were adjusted in the same year the increasing age average and improving medical care offers opportunities for foreign drug manufacturers to expand into the chinese market the new regulations could help as they are similar to other international standards Title: The announcement 111 2020 on the system for the traceability for pharmaceutical products. Competent authority: Chinese National Medical Products Administration. Info. Products: Pharmaceuticals. Code type: 1D barcode, G's 12D data matrix or FIT tag. Time frame: final implementation within 2022 drug manufacturers who want to supply the chinese market must overcome some hurdles beforehand for example documents are only provided in the local language this makes it difficult for small and medium sized companies to understand and comply with the requirements in addition the responsible chinese authority the national medical products administration npa is reluctant to set an exact deadline as the serialization project has been delayed several times in recent years currently only a compliance date during 2022 is known from this point onwards drugs must be traceable by a product identification code This will consist of the drug identification code and a unique serial number. Code requirements. Currently, it is planned to allow two different serialization procedures. The system introduced in 2015 will remain in place and will be supplemented by a refurbished one. In the previous system, marketing authorization holders had to request serialization codes from the government. This is a 20 digit numbering code called the China Drug Electronic Administration Code, the code which consists of different segments, each consisting of coded serial numbers. As a result, only a small portion of the serial numbers are randomly generated, so anti-counterfeiting does not result from randomization. In the new regulation for drug traceability in China, the government is no longer the issuer for serial numbers. Instead, manufacturers and pharmaceutical serialization providers must comply to a new concept for serial number assignment. A concept is seen as compliant if the new regulation of the China National Drug Code (CNDC) is followed. It is based on ISO/IEC 15459, has 14 digits and is similar to the G's one global trade item number (GITN) standard. However, this code can be assigned not only by G's one, but also by other issuing bodies that adhere to the relevant ISO. Thus, the responsibility for creating a traceability system is placed on them as manufacturers. The old, as well as the new code, consists of a product identification code. This must provide human and machine readable information about the generic drug name. formulation license holder manufacturer package specification specification and dosage form what is required for chinese packaging as in other regions the product identification code on a chinese package must be machine and human readable only one of the two permitted codes must be selected and applied to the package The machine readable code is a one-dimensional barcode. 
In human readable form, it is alphanumeric, also contains symbols and can consist of up to 128 characters. In contrast, the updated China National Drug Code CNDC, is one or two dimensional for machines and alphanumeric for humans. There is also the special feature that the CNDC can make use of an AFID tag for machine readability. Additionally, both codes can contain expiration date, production date, batch and serial number and my information. Where do we go from here? With the vague deadline and specifications continuing to change, it remains important to keep an eye on announcements from the Chinese National Medical Products Administration (NPA). A quick adjustment to upcoming implementations could become essential here. Manufacturers should therefore be vigilant about future developments. An experienced pharmaceutical serialization provider would be able to assist in meeting changing regulations and offer support throughout the process. Disclaimer This information is only one possible interpretation of the regulations. They are also constantly changing, so the information in this article may be incomplete or out of date. The above article is expressly not legal advice. Please consult the official documents for more information before making any business decisions. हमारे चैनल को प्लीज सब्सक्राइब कीजिए और हमें मोटिवेट कीजिए थैंक यू